We're in beautiful Cabo San Lucas, Mexico, hanging out with Cabo Adventures. This is where they do their bike tours and camel tours and stuff. It's just a beautiful piece of property. It's the evening, kind of a great sunset ride. This is Moni. How's it going, babe? Hola. My girlfriend is on a Volt Bike Mariner. This is your favorite bike out of the bunch, right? Yeah, it's like low step, you know, fun to ride. And I am on the Rad Rover, um, just classic high step. We're gonna go through the hills and maybe check out some beautiful lookouts. I'm probably gonna be using this on, you know, pedal assist three or four, the occasional throttle. And so you can kind of see what it's like, you know, with an electric bike. What time is it, by the way? Seven o'clock. About seven o'clock, so it's just perfect. Let's do it. I think we're. We're all set there. Here we go. Power it up. Pedal assist four. You ready? <laughs> you got your Garmin too? Yeah. Pedal assist four is pretty rapid. I'm gonna actually take it down to three or two while we're on this. Rain here. There we go. A little bit softer. These fat bikes are great. When you lower the pressure, it gives you a little bit of cushion. Um, smooths out the ride, but it also helps with sand, so you don't spin out or you know lose control. And I'm gonna get up to three for this little climb. And this battery is relatively full, but you see that the voltage dips when you're climbing, and then you start to coast for a second, and it inches its way back up, <laughs> which is kind of cool. Shifting gears. this washboard stuff. It's not a whole lot of fun to go over on a car. Oh, look at the bunny. Jackrabbit <laughs> cruising across the trail. So now I'm throttling it. We're up to like 20 miles per hour on that section. Keeping an eye out for these ruts. Oh, look, another one. Chasing all the bunnies, huh? <laughs> That's awesome. And I like that on the Mariner, it's got a seat post that it's got suspension, so it smooths out those bumps a little bit. But you want to stand up to take some of that the edge off. A cactus. Ooh, another rabbit. Oh, two of them. You know, there's a little bit of noise being produced, but not a lot. I mean, not nearly as much as an automobile or a four, four wheeler or something. Of course, our range is only 20 miles, you know, they say 20 to 40, but when we're running low PSI like this, climbing hills. Steep hill. There you go, whoa. Got some erosion happening here. Shift down. Good job, babe. It's fun when you can both like challenge each other a little bit. I mean, she's an athlete. She does like long distance running and stuff, but She's not quite as balanced on bicycles. And having a little bit of that assist lets you focus more on balance than trying to pedal and everything too. Huh. 
There you go. Beautiful flowers. I'm gonna go up the big trail. Soft stuff. No problem. Okay, this is where you actually wanna take down your pedal assist a little bit because you want to go slower. And sometimes it's like pushing you hard through those corners. And that's where you slide out. I think that's happened to Moni a couple times. Let's look back and see how she's doing. Nice, babe. No problem. No problem. A little bit of practice, get a lot more confident. I don't feel out of breath or anything right now. This would be a pretty strenuous bike ride without an assist. Let's go back down to assist three. Oh. Yeah. What were you saying, babe? Bunny. Oh, another bunny, yeah. So what do you think? Should we go to the little cave? Yeah. And try it? Do you know how to get there? We don't, no, uh-uh. It's an adventure. Hopefully you don't get a flat tire or something. This is where we went the other day, up on that peak. It was neat. I think just down there is the cave. Smuggler's Den, they call it. Yeah, it's down those steep sections. You gotta take it easier, you slide out. Good job. Surf's up. Look at those waves. Oh, and here's some soft sand right here. Really soft. Really soft and footprints. Yeah, I think like right through here. Oh boy, really soft. This is like, this is like the softest sand. Oh, look at that. Wow. Doing all right, babe? Yeah. Wow. wow. Isn't that awesome? We didn't know what this was. I just thought it was like a cave from before. It's all good. awesome. Want to walk out there a little bit? It's pretty. Do you carry your phone? My what? Your phone? No, I don't. 
Is my, uh, oh, for a picture? Huh? Is this recording? Yep. Nice. Sorry I can't give you a kiss. I'm wearing a camera on my face. Let's do it. Let's go out here. Man, look at that wave. Wow. Oh, the crabs. Cangrejos. Love ya. Miss you recording? Yeah. Can you stop a little bit? I can edit it out. Want to hop on and go to the, along the beach and stuff? Mm -hmm. Do you want me to take my helmet off and give you a kiss? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hold those for a second. Jeez. <laughs> Okay, let's keep riding. Sixty calories so far. It's mostly just because you got my heart racing back there with that kiss. <laughs> you ready to keep going? Okay. So this time we're going to cut down to the beach. And ride that back. I'm going to try to do the sand again. This is the really tricky stuff. Yeehaw! Doesn't seem that tricky unless you try to turn. She's got it. Pretty much. Wanna go up to the peak again? Yeah, just go ahead. Try to get up the top of that. Like last time? Okay. Do you mind if I go up there real quick? Okay, I'll go up there. Just wait at the base. She wants to go to the beach, of course. There we go. So that there's no pedal information, I didn't bring my cadence sensor. Take it a little bit easy. And that's where we just were. Beautiful. That's the, ooh, the arch. I can feel my heart beating a little bit faster now. Still got tons of energy. Okay, let's keep this going. Yeah. Here's where you really need to slow it down a little bit. Climbing. It's 
do it. It's nice to have those brake lever inhibitors because several times I've been like needing to stop quickly on that more uh, difficult terrain. Because you know, you don't want to slide out, you don't want to fall off. You just hit those brake lever inhibitors and it does it. This, this bike only has a six magnet cadence sensor. Cadence sensors in general just aren't as responsive as like uh, you know, a torque sensor. But they're cheaper. They don't require you to push very hard, just move your feet. Body check. Cool, here we go. Oh boy, using that back brake. you get really good at it, you can actually kind of lean through these corners and it's a lot of fun. 10 miles per hour can seem pretty fast <laughs> when the terrain gets a little sketchy. There's the beach. It's beautiful. we're gonna go out on that rock out there. That'll be cool. Whee! Oh yeah. This crack is really cool. Good job, babe. Let's go a little bit further. These fat tires are really stable. They just really, they make you feel like anything's possible. Nice, how are you feeling? Good. This is a pretty special spot. It looks like the tide's coming up a little bit, so should we keep going? <laughs> yep. You know, thinking about you guys too, trying to keep the, keep things moving, show you all around. Oh my gosh, that tide. Ready? Why don't you go ahead this time? I'll follow you. Nice and easy. There you go, babe. Oh yeah. It's a really cool feature. It's going to do the beach. here all day making different tracks, doing reviews, hanging out. It's our little reward ride. She's doing great. 
Oh, soft stuff. Crabs. Little fiddler crabs. Yeah, woo! Great job, babe. That was excelente. Yeah. I'm gonna go up this. Yeah, that's true. We gotta watch out for the sea lions. Give them some space. Whee! It's beautiful. I spent a lot of time in LA and uh, I love it. But you don't get a beach like this where it's literally just you and the ocean and your friends enjoying the fresh air, exploring, not worrying about you know, laws or whatever. I mean, we're, we're using stuff that's environmentally friendly, quiet. They were out here picking up trash the other day, rescuing sea turtles. It's just really, it's really idyllic. It's very cool. It's where the sea, sea lions were yesterday. I'm gonna go down by the water again. <laughs> Look at all the little crabs. Oh boy, getting a little wet. Probably don't want to ride these bikes in salt water like that. I definitely don't. That was just an accident. Got a little too close. These waves can kind of sneak up on you. Sunset. You've been doing great, babe. How are you feeling? Good. I'm at nine though. You're what? I'm at nine. At nine? Oh, you're in the highest level. Yeah. Is it working? Yeah. You haven't you haven't had any issues. You're really stable. Okay, let's keep back from these guys a little bit. This is the sea turtle rescue place right over there. Maybe they're looking for sea turtles. Time to turn on that backlighting. Let's see, we hold up. And power. There we go. I can read it a little easier. I got my headlight going now. Oh yeah. Be fun little skimboarding spot right here, maybe. Wow.
gonna try it just with no assist right now. Oh my gosh. Literally standing up, working very hard and struggling. Okay, there we go. Bringing it back, bringing it back. Whew. Huh. Almost immediately exhausting. There's the moon, or the sun. Beautiful sunset. Said we'd watch the sunsets together. This might be our first chance. Whew. How you doing? On the patio? To your right. Derecha. Sunset dinner. Wow. I know, right? Should I sell him? <laughs> Came from all the way down there. Three point six miles. Not bad. I accidentally went through the water. No way, really? I was like, look at the ocean. <laughs> it, like the wave came up. Is my camera? Does it have water on the lens? Nice. Oh. Misty? Yeah. Yeah, salty like mist stuff. Thanks, babe. Oh, bye. Should we hop on the road and get back up to the thing? Before it gets too dark? We have 30 minutes. Oh, really? It's like 7.34. Should we hang out here a little longer? Okay. Thanks for joining us on that awesome ride. Thanks again to Cabo Adventures and uh, Bolt Bike and Rad Power Bikes. It's been a lot of fun. It's been a lot of fun. Ride safe. See you next time. Adios. Adios. Okay. Yeah, we spent some romantic time at the beach, watched a beautiful sunset, and I got the light on. Thought that would be kind of cool to show. We're just heading back up to the pickup point. You ready? Let's do it. Hey, you got your light on too. Nice, babe. Why don't you go in front? I want to adjust mine. Feels like it's it's not aimed down a little far, but whatever. Yours has a brake light. I like that. Yeah, the yellow flowers are beautiful. And these moths, they've got these beautiful moths and hummingbirds. Oh, it's a, I think it's a jackrabbit. There it is. Uh, that's right, we gotta be careful with the camels. Cool. It's the sea turtle rescue place. Gordon. Left or right? Right. Hola. Caballo. Oh boy.
Hola. Ah. Yeah. Jorge, ¿cómo están? ¿Cómo estás, Jorge? Muy bien. bien. Mónica y Jorge. ¡Uy, vale! ¿Estás bien, right, baby? Yeah. ¿Qué tal? ¿Están bien? Ok. Qué padre. Creo que ese es el final. Gracias de nuevo.